This is Long Night Moon by Cynthia Ryland. Long Night Moon. Long ago, Native Americans gave names to the full moons they watched throughout the year. Each month had a moon, and each moon had its name. In January, the stormy moon shines in mist and ice on a wild wolf's back. Find it and find your way home. In February, a snow moon glows white sharp in a cool crackling breath. It will miss its sister, the sun. In March, a sap moon rises over melting ponds, sleepy bears, small green trees. It tells a promise and a hope. In April, the sprouting grass moon brings all wanderers back home. Baby birds love this moon. It lights their tiny heads. In May, a flower moon blooms wide open bright, happy to be here. It is a smiling moon. It is a song. In June, the strawberry moon shimmers on succulent buds, on crisp new shoots, on quiet, grateful rabbits. There is, in the dark, a moonlight meal. In July, the thunder moon trembles, shudders, and disappears in a thick black sky. It listens to the clouds beat their drums. In August, a harvest moon grows round and full like a big ripe melon, blessing the calm fields of hay. In September, a coon moon watches for shining eyes and busy feet, little brown noses in the air. It loves the small night creatures. It shows them a better path. In October, the acorn moon comes strong yellow, the biggest moon of the year. Leaves are falling and birds are flying. This moon says goodbye. In November, a frosty moon holds a hard ground. Empty trees, the wind in lonely places. It shivers with the shining stars. It thinks it might just sleep. And in December, the long night moon waits and waits and waits for morning. This is the faithful moon. This one is your friend.
Now I want you to listen to the story again. And this time, I want you to see if you can find where there's personification, which is where we have objects that are acting like humans or have human characteristics. And I want you to see if you can find metaphors and similes. So see if you can find that figurative language. I will see you soon. Bye.